All right, guys. So it was good here. The hoodie. All right, back. And I do have some new content. I've been really meaning to do this for a minute. For a really, really, really freaking long this time. I'm not going to take too long in this video. But we freaking have, like, just... For Beyblade, anyway. Yeah, so Beyblade. This is the longest thing I've been really wanting to do for my channel for, like, a minute. It's just... I've been just, like, you know, busy with other content as well. You know, I'm doking. Um... Ben 10, Spider-Man, all that little, little stuff. I'm mean, kind of, you know, no busy. I, I need to really get back on Spider-Man because there's a lot of little details and stuff I want to go over this new game and stuff. Um, I mean, the PS4 game, we all know that. Everybody loves it. I just, I think I have a little bit more news on that. Um, I'll probably maybe do it tomorrow, maybe, or whatever, because, you know, Doug has a little bit of stuff going on. But, you know, Piccolo being, um, Doug and Fest, Shuni, him, Fuse, Wakami, also with, um, LR Prime Battle Cell, first form, or first form part of Prime Battle Physical LR. So, he's, I think, yeah, he is like the last of LR Physical Prime Battle unit. So, it's really great though. Um, so, yeah, for Beyblade. Finally, 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 finally getting to this. It's been maybe like a year since I tried to do it. I'm um, just, you know, doing something new because Ben 10 is really great right now with Doken Amazing, honestly. I uh, just like everything on my channel is really good. I want Beyblade to hit it hard because I do love Beyblade ever since I was like, what, 11, 10 when the series first came on. Um, yeah, like with Jenga, Kyoya, Ryuga, you know, all of them. So yeah, for, so for the new ones, actually, I wanted to say right here, we freaking finally got the new uh, base out. So we have Air Knight, finally. Um, we have Triple Achilles. Um, this is like Wave 4. Then um, we finally have the newest one. We, I think we just had, like, current one, we just had, like, with, um, um, I wish it was called Buster, um, or Breaker Escalius. But the English version calls it. We finally have Dread Phoenix, one of my favorite Beyblades from the series. Um, Loki. And, like, we are getting a new Lord Spryzen from the new GT series. And Iga's coming back as well. I will do videos on them probably in the next few days, maybe. Or I might do... Yeah, again, I still gotta do this part of my video. But, yeah, like, this is freaking great, though. It's, you know, plastic and stuff like that. But, um... So, I have, um, gotten, like, actually metal and stuff. I know, like, um... Recently, I just saw, um, at my local Walmart, I actually saw, um... Which one called? I saw somebody... I saw somebody... Might have been, um, I can't think of it right now. Um, uh, um, I just said, I just said his name, um, Breaker Escalius, um, or Buster. I don't know, I'm still used to saying it because you know, Hasbro, Teratomi, and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, though, he actually has actually, he's the first, very first Bomb Beaver that actually has metal on it. Again, you guys have no stickers, which I'm still kind of a little bit pissed off because I love putting on stickers. And I was like, getting stuff, I was like putting on stickers. And I got a little bit here and there, but yeah, though. So yeah, um, but the gimmick with Air Knight, I think it goes, has more like air direction maybe in the air a little bit. So, you know, if you want to work around that, plus it has like, you know, I'm um, like kind of like a shield thing on it. So, the big like circular part around it right here. So, it's really great though. And plus, um, I am going to do drifting class because again, I do love this bridge design and stuff. Um, again, they have changed a lot. Even the um, the dimension driver for um, 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 Turbo Achilles actually is different as well because I actually go up fully, like, you can go up a lot instead of um, actually being you know, um, um, it can go up like just more, like, it can go up the height is a little bit more than um, the Japanese version. Um, carbon I mean, for that after. Um, but yeah, that was a little bit higher, so you're getting a little bit more attack out of it. So it's kind of weird, but at the same time, yeah, this is the fourth again, this is the fourth wave. You can go look at like I know I saw it like and I saw like Keith Salamander too. So I guess he's part of that wave as well. I do like like I do always like the main series of Beyblades because they are you know, I mean they're not, not different from the regular Beyblades. Some of them come in like a two pack, like Revive Phoenix comes in like a two pack, um I know Spiral Shred Tomb um, comes in a two pack. Um just you know little stuff here and there. Um, also with, um, you know, Dread Phoenix is the armor, the armor gimmick, me basically you can fly off and get an actually like pierce, kind of like a piercing attack. You can kind of use it with Turbo Achilles, it's actually at the burst locker. I heard it's like more easier to launch off now, like you had to rip really hard to, um, get the, um, launch it to actually come, like the, um, Turbo Blades to actually activate. Uh, yeah, they're called Turbo Blades, you know. Um, so you can, um, you know, basically it's burst locker, so you can't burst, so basically every time, you know, we hit three clicks, you're not gonna like actually burst automatically, you're just gonna, um, um, you have like little locks right there in the right, like over right over here. I'll probably go over it in another video as well. Um, but just that, like, every time you like hit the bay and stuff, like, really hard, it's gonna start clicking. When it hits that point, I have like, um, plastic, probably like plastic, um, points where, um, it would like just lock in and like these parts will start popping out. Well, they'll pop out when you rip really hard. So, ours is like a little bit more easier as well with the, um, as a bro version. So, that is really great. I'm really hyped for this. I'm ready to go to Walmart, ready to go get these guys. Not today, but you know, whenever I am there, yeah. Yeah, again with Dread Phoenix, the armor gimmick comes off. And the battery mode is a little bit more aggressive. Like, um, okay, like this armor coming off and stuff is kind of like, you know, a little bit harder, I think. Um, even like with the regular Revive Phoenix, it's kind of hard to do that as well. Yeah, it's called Dread Phoenix, like, because, um, for um, the English version as well, for, um, 
dead. Um, Hades is called Dread now, so I guess I kind of changed it. If, like, you know, so it won't sound too grimy because, you know, gravity is like that. They're doing stuff back and forth. Um, again, I am really happy for these two. Again, Air Knight is still really great, though. It's really good. Um, again, the hype is one I'm probably going to get. It's like um, Dread Hades. And Battle Ring Mode, I think, is a little bit more. Um, slightly aggressive, because, you know, slightly aggressive. You still, I think you can still go, like, the ultimate attack mode, I think, with, um, Z Achilles. No, ah, triple Achilles. I heard it's, like, um, yeah, like, ultimate, like, attack mode, like, ultimate balance mode or something like that. Yeah, like, probably, like, the typical attack defense demo. Like, like how the hyper over Z Achilles, um, you can buy, like, separately. There's, like, a dark, I saw, like, a dark version of it. That's all the regular red version. That's all, like, a evil version like loki of wonder about trick that's if you buy it separately though. if you buy it with the pack actual pack like in the, um stadium stuff like the rail stadium um it'll actually come in as regular colors but it's all plastic though it's not really um i guess they um did they didn't do metal because they know it's too because you know the original metal fight um or the regular old beyblades um if you guys don't know those actually um had like a lot of metal on it and it was considered probably like um they probably changed it because you know it's still gonna be safer because with this um it's a little bit more the plastic i guess is more safer so it won't be you know like like when you grab it and stuff won't like um hurt you or something like that, I guess. That's probably like the oh I they removed like all the metal on the Beyblades now, that's why it's all full of plastic. So people won't get hurt and stuff like that. That's why I like a safety precaution properly. Like with Turbo Killers, yeah, this is all plastic, it's not metal, so like the Japanese version, I guess so a uh, Japanese version, so I guess you won't like hurt yourself. Glow blades are probably like kinda sh not sharp sharp, but probably like probably considered too dangerous. So that's why um they always do that though. So yeah, see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out, have a great day, great life, everything. Finally got Beyblade coming from my channel. I'm gonna do more videos, heck of more videos, heck of more stuff. See you guys later. Peace out. Have a great day. The video went a little bit too long, longer than I expected, but yeah. See you guys later. Peace out.